I will never in my fucking lifetime ever again try kombucha, bro. Cause, bro, bro, just listen to this. So one night I was working at my job, and you know, um, I work in the produce department, so they, they sell kombucha there. And I decided to let me let me let me try some kombucha. You know, let me broaden my horizons. Let me let me get my taste buds. Uh, active and it was a buy one get one that day so you know it's just shit it's a win-win so i bought two different flavors because I, I thought maybe if i didn't like one flavor i like the other one that's that's what i thought now one thing my dumbass was doing before i even bought it i shook the fuck out of it because i thought it was just normal juice and we'll get onto that later so i opened it and from the smell alone i knew this wasn't this this was not normal what the hell is this i looked at it and i was like um okay whatever but i, I decided to try it anyway. and when i tell you that shit had me flabbergasted you wouldn't believe it bro like it was so nasty <laughs> bro okay let me describe what the taste is like to y'all this shit Tastes like rotten fruit. Like, have you ever accidentally bitten into a rotten fruit without knowing it? Or, you know, some of y'all probably do that shit on purpose. I don't know. But that's what it tasted like. Rotten fruit. And I was like, yo, what the fuck is this? So I opened the other one. It was like, hey, man, maybe this one different. It was not. I was like, yo, bro, these shits is the same taste. Rotten fruit, bro. Like, who the fuck decided that it was rotten fruit to put in it but jp it said that it's made out of fermented fruit on the bottle bro it's the same shit like fermented rotten same difference nigga like bro it tasted like ass and it does not stop there just guess what guess what bro these people decided to make that shit carbonated bro this has to be illegal somewhere somehow because there is no way a company is allowed to take rotten fruit, turn it into a juice, and carbonate it. It's like soda, but with rotten fruit. Like, who's who decided this was a good idea, bruh? Okay, I wouldn't recommend it, but I'm gonna tell y'all to do this. Go, go to your local store, and if you haven't, buy a bottle of kombucha and, and, and tell... Come back to the comments and tell me what you think. Let me know what your first taste was like. And what's crazy is some people actually like to buy this shit, bro. Like, what? Loki, it reminded me of the first time I tried broccoli, bro. And honestly, that was my first mistake, trying it to begin with. Because as a kid, we were conditioned by cartoons to hate broccoli. Like, none of the kids we liked in cartoon liked broccoli. So I don't know why I tried it to begin with. And my second mistake... Drum roll, please. It was the school lunch. Bro, let me tell you that that shit that shit was not it, bro. So I was in high school uh, when I did this. Um, uh, I, I went to the school lunch and I was like, bro, let me let me let me try broccoli for the first time. Maybe it's not that bad. I looked at the broccoli, and I took a bite. Let let me find a way to describe what it, this thing tasted like, bro. Have have you ever tried dry water? Like I know it sounds stupid. But that's exactly what this shit tasted like. Dry fucking water. All right, picture this for a second. You take a broccoli, right? You boil that bit and just leave it like that. That's it, bro. That shit just tasted like boiled water and vegetable. Bro, I'm telling you, that shit just ruined my first experience with broccoli forever. I was like, bro, I'm never doing this shit again, bro. And then here comes everybody with their opinions when I tell them. Oh, you should try it with melted cheese or some salt. Bro, shut up. It's... The, the, it's not the same. I already lost my first experience with this shit. Like, nigga, like dry water, bro. That's what that shit tasted like. Dry water. Eventually, I did try broccoli again, and it tastes slightly better. Just bland. I never tried anybody else's suggestions with cheese and ketchup or whatever the hell they wanted to add on there, right? But yeah, that was my first experience with broccoli and kombucha. If you made it this far into the video, might as well go ahead and subscribe. I got more random shit to talk about.